Okay, I'm going to do a quick review of the APR Mobile. Um, the APR Mobile dongle is plugged in to the diagnostic port right under here, right under the dash, which is easily accessible. Um, I have the APR Mobile app here on my iPhone. So I'm going to launch the app. And the first thing you'll notice the quickly happened is the Bluetooth icon went from yellow to green in the top right showing that it's connected to the dongle um, and it shows the current program um, which is presently saying the 93 octane tune and that no faults are reported. Across the bottom you have the home screen which is this and then the EMCS screen which is where your tunes are. Because I have the loaded chip I have four programs here. I have stock, uh, 91 octane, 93 octane, 100 octane. Um, so presently it's set to the 93. What's nice about this is it works on the fly. If I click st select stock, you'll notice the EPC light flashed one time, indicating the program in slot one is now active. If I go to 91 octane, you'll see the light flash twice. Third slot two, three, and that's, how you, and that's how you switch programs right on the fly. The fault codes piece, you select it, slide down to refresh, there's no fault codes to, to uh, report, so nothing is showing, but I have had it where the fault codes will show up, give you the actual code, and then you're given the, the additional option to clear all fault codes, and as soon as you hit that, the fault codes clear. Um, and then there's a logging component. Um, these are the available logging groups for this particular ECU. Um, so there's a whole bunch of groups that come by default. So I could do boost and fueling diagnosis. Here are all the measurable graph settings. You So I have misfires, which I could apply to um, graph 2, as well as you know engine speed. And then for graph one, I could do fuel pressure, um, actual and fuel pressure specified, and say start. And then I get the two logs, which you could then pause, um, email. Uh, there's a there's a whole series. You could pause them, and then once once you do have your graph, you can actually um, email them directly to yourself as a CSV file. But that's pretty it. I've been fairly happy with it. Um, initially, the the documentation for installing it was somewhat um, ambiguous. The, the big thing is when you first plug in the dongle, you have to go to settings, go to your Bluetooth um, setting, and you'll see the APR mobile dongle and click on it to actually establish a connection to it. But that's really it.